Hey man, I need y'all to get the fuck off the train at the next stop. Cause I think y'all fucking playing with me. Nigga hits the emergency exit and the door flies off. What kind of emergency would call for that last resort? So boom, today we talking about one of my favorite movies I've ever seen. From a top tier cast, funny ass moments, a solid story, and uh, nothing but hands. But we gotta hold off till we get there later. And obviously, I'm not gonna talk about every little detail. Cause that's boring. But anyway, let's get straight to it. So basically, the whole movie is revolving around the white death in his briefcase. That's it. I mean, he got a son, but <laughs> that nigga don't matter. Look what they do to him in the first 10 minutes. <laughs> Wah, wah. I read about a, a did you say want want to a and the white death got to be the cleanest villain I've ever seen in any movie we barely get to see him which means he got a more of a intimidating presence and a nigga Russian and every Russian is cold besides the shit with his wife and they they gotta let that part out and that shit make him look weak but other than that a top tier villain it's also this grown little girl I don't know <laughs> But she on the train too, and she pushed this nigga's son off of a roof just to get him, and <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with y'all, that shit really doesn't fucking matter. I mean, in the end, yeah, it matter, I guess, but shit, I don't care about this plot line. But little grown girl, her goal is to kill the white death. But she pretty boring, though, I'm not gonna lie. And the last main character is my nigga Ladybug, and he, he, he cool. Okay, cool. But the two niggas. The main reason I made this video right here, my niggas Lemon and Tangerine. Everybody favorite characters in this movie, probably everybody favorite duo in any movie, to be honest. But that's every character that's important in this movie, so we finna get into it. And one of my favorite scenes is when Ladybug and Lemon box in a quiet car. And the fact that they got a box in pure silence, it's pure cinema. So Ladybug pull up and hit him with the, a gun under this table. And look at his face. He do not give a fuck. Round one. Fight. And this That's is what, what we've been, been waiting, waiting on. For. This is what we wanted all along. So they get his meat wool from under the table. Ladybug pop up, closes the computer on this nigga hand, and sneak him with a right from his back pocket. And Buddy think he's solo going after this man's throat. Pause. Then... Pause again. Freaky ass movie. Nigga got straight Shaboying in the camera. Yo, pause again. Nigga giving feet jobs on the bullet train. Sign me up. What are we talking about? What are we talking about? And let me throw the laptop and up the stick shoe niggas. But my nigga escapes it, grabbing his gun and smashing his skull against the window. And as he's finna get shot, he disarms the gun. Spikes his nigga throat, and then pistol with that fuck nigga. He got him in that coquina coat. Reloads the gun and bug just barely escapes. Grabs the computer and home run. And start working on his resume. He's a pack of dicks, lady. So after that fight, we learn that the twins are at the ladybug and the little white girl still at the white death. But who the fuck cares, am I right? And round two for the hands is ladybug versus lemon. This nigga is running a gauntlet on the bullet train. But the hands here were fantastico oisidora. Whatever that little Mexican bitch be saying. But tries to kick this nigga and gets that shit caught. Starts feeding this shit to the Shaboy, but he gets countered and Tangerine starts feeding him some hard shit. And with a smooth stage change, we get back to the hand. Ladybug, old cartoon ass nigga. He trying to use environment. I'm trying to see these, nigga. I know you got them. And that boy Tangerine hit me loud and clear, so he starts throwing them hard bitches. And Ladybug starts weave, weave. We even his shit. He grabs a board, cracks made across his scully, and he's trying to talk it out. You must be some kind of a dumb <laughs> I know them hands work, buddy. Get to using them. And Ladybug Gatorade meter starts to flash him. So he got to get himself a little <sighs> swig of water. And he heaves the bottle at this nigga, man. Streets don't play fair. Then he put that boy through some glass and feed him one more for the road. Then, whoa, whoa, whoa. Nigga trying to strangle him with a seatbelt. Hashtag freaky deaky. And with his back up against the ropes, this nigga hits the emergency exit and the door flies off. 
what kind of emergency would call for that last resort? But they climb back in and they stop. Because this nigga get a phone call from the white death. Hey man, I need y'all to get the fuck off the train at the next stop. Cause I think y'all fucking playing with me. So now these niggas gotta become be best friends, friends forever. forever. And they step off with the case and Ladybug gotta be the biggest it, seller like of the all way time. You do business. Nigga had the TD and ran in the opposite direction. And we get back to the, oh man, we don't want to see this. But my nigga Lemon in the scene, so let's cut to the chase. So have any of you bruvs seen this case? Oh no, we haven't seen a briefcase. Why well, the hell did you know I was talking about a briefcase, bruv? And not a suit. Why do you is the diesel? Well, it ain't me. Well, it ain't me. I'm gonna shoot one of y'all. If you don't tell the bloody truth, mate. It was him. Bow, brother. If it was him, why didn't you just use... Uh-oh. Come on, man. That's the way. Bow. Bow, 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 bow. And with that, my nigga Lemon is in a pack. And God, why him? Why him? And with Lemon gone, Tangerine gets drop kicked straight out the train. And he got to chase down Badge of the Hell. And plunge his way back onto the train. And the next body on the train is the Hornet. And now she ran into Ladybug. And this nigga has had four back to back to back fights. Give this nigga a break. And ring the bell. So she goes for a high kick, but get it blocked. And hits that boy with a heart punch. Again. And again. And these boys feeling real romantical. But he gets cut short with a hug. And they get back to feeling romantical. But then she hit him with her own hug. And stabs that boy with a Zika shit. But she didn't pull it. And he pull it out and inject her with her own shit. And guess what? She died. And no, I cannot show this shit on YouTube. With Tangerine finding out Lemon is dead, he starts to crash out. Fuck! I hate that word. And find a little bitch. And he gets the assist from Lemon from hell. Cause it's no way that brother is up there with the good lord. But this is one of my favorite scenes, and I'm not even gonna say too much. I'ma let it play out. It's been a diesel running up and down this train, causing all sorts of fucking havoc. And it was you the whole fucking time, you dirty little diesel! You made lemon bleed, and lemon never bleeds. And it somehow followed immediately by one of my least favorite scenes. <laughs> because how can you kill two of the cleanest niggas in the movie? And the one thing I hate about this movie is it's way too many fucking kills. Fuck is this, the kill count? Nigga, am I James A. Janice? Stop killing these niggas, man. Fuck. And am I tripping? But does this bitch look like a little girl to anybody else? She look grown as shit. But I guess that make too much sense, huh? And Pervy says, get on the train. And he the father of the nigga that got his shit kablammed earlier. And he recognized his old girl voice. And the old nigga got hoes watching over his grandson. Pop, pop of the year type shit. And then he get on the train and start telling his life story and shit. But I ain't here for all that. But he knows the white death. Dun, dun, dun like shit and in a few minutes these niggas gotta fade with the white death so it's gonna be nothing but bodies on no bullet train Fight. Ah, ah, he said it he said it and somehow this nigga is still alive man fuck your son lemon <sighs> so that must mean tangerine not dead we up oh that's fucking stupid why kill a cold ass character just to bring back a character that nobody give a fuck about. And this final battle scene, it's cool. But this is such a random group of niggas to be left alive. Like, I get that the, the nigga got to... I don't even know this nigga name. The Asian nigga. I get that he got to be alive for his son. But killing Lemon, brother? Like, come on, bro. Tangerine and Lemon. That could have been the final two. That could have been the final two with my nigga Ladybug and the old nigga. Old nigga just come to avenge his son. What the fuck? That's all y'all had to do? I don't give a fuck about this nigga's son. I give more of a fuck about every other character that built something. Why have somebody built up just to kill him? We finna get into the final battle. So, the white death. Niggas not trying to throw them bitches at all. Niggas get on the train with nothing but gun. I fear it's up for them boys on that train. And first up, it's 
the daughter of the white yeah. I'm not gonna lie. It was quite obvious when you watched the whole movie. I'm not gonna hold you. And since there's a lot of moving parts, I'm gonna need y'all to pay attention. Yeah, you, the nigga who probably watching this is background noise, doing their homework and shit. Pay attention before I lose you. So Ladybug get these niggas the case, and he's still finna get his shit s -s -s samurai slice. Like the like button. Go ahead and do that if you haven't already. We jump back on the train, and the little deaf holding a gun, but get that shit Jackie Chan from him. Squeeze it, nigga. She wanted too bad. And she get hit with the fucking Gogeta for all her efforts. Nigga pulled that bitch and confetti came out. I'm sick. And push her out the way like the insignificant character she face, is. Bitch. And the white death. Start fucking monologuing. I know he ain't watched The Incredibles. That's rule number one of what you're not supposed to do. But his plan was to get all the assassins on the train to kill each other. I'm not gonna hold you. Excellent plan. But this nigga was hold on all fronts. Because Tangerine and Lemon body his crew, the Hornet bodied the surgeon who's supposed to operate on her wife. Him, her, her, him, bodies, 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 bodies. A whole bunch of blood in this bitch, goddamn. But he missed one final person, the nigga that actually killed his wife. Because the nigga who killed his bitch was Ryan Reynolds. Kaboom! And we active. Old nigga Harry Poppins is kept and weaves all the bullets. Whips out his katana cane and starts slicing niggas. We pop in on his son and he get lit too. And Yuichi starts hitting niggas with plushies. Oh, nah. We got him over Tangerine. He kind of cold though, I, I guess. guess. And some of the old man shit. I cannot show on YouTube because he doing a little too much. But he linked with the white death and the old niggas get to talking. My way, or you will join your wife. Bo, 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 my wife, stupid bitch. Whoa. Shawty, you little baddie. She, she know the little boo thing. And Shawty got the fatty. I see why he tight, but white death. You doing too much over this expired milk, gang. And we back with Lemon and he hit a triple drop kick. Man's feeling himself in it, bro. He feeling different and it might hit him with a spine buster through the ceiling. Black, 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 black. And with the train fucked up, these niggas start making condolences, man. Aww. And this lame ass nigga hit a superhero entrance just to get bonked in his meat. And hey, this goof ass nigga wanna hit the emergency exit. He did not hit you that hard. And with that assist kill from Ladybug, him and Lemon are finally cool. Gore! Gore to the outside! Gore to the outside! My God, he's broken in the ass! And we finally back to the old nigga scrap. And yeah, I know, you wondering. Well, Demora, what happened since you skipped all over it? Here, nigga, damn! To eat? No. But even a flex on this nigga before death? That's or if I've ever seen it. And this nigga yanks the brakes. And these niggas fuck up the whole train. You can't take niggas nowhere. But somehow, all of these niggas are still alive until... Okay. Kablam! And I cannot show that shit on YouTube. But if you want to subscribe to the I'm Demarian Patreon, I'm trolling, I'm trolling, I'm trolling. Chill! But I will be starting this Discord at 1000. Yeah! Oh, shit, the movie, the movie. And who gonna kill a little white girl? <laughs> and that's all for the movie. And shit, my baby Sandra Bullock in this bitch too. Let me hit it one more time. Shorty a little buddy. She my little boo thing. And Shorty got the fatty. Shorty got the fatty. She my little boo thing. But we out, brothers. I'ma see y'all in the next one, man. Deuces. Money. I know I can't afford it. Wish they would just check it. Back when I was young, I'd ask and I get it. No matter how hard.